Hey beautiful people, how are y'all doing today? This is a little change of scenery because I wanted to get outside to film this intro. Welcome back to my channel if you are a regular viewer here and if you're new to my channel, hello! My name is Mahala Tendergachu and I am an Ethiopian American artist and I make art videos, college videos, and all that kind of stuff, all that good shit. And if you're interested in that, feel free to subscribe. Welcome back to another video. This is another little studio vlog. Um, doing a lot of art making, packaging orders, and uh, some fun businessy things, you know, Miss Girl Boss type things. <laughs> and I low key don't remember what goes on in this video. Um, but I hope you enjoy it. Don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe to my channel because it lets me know that y'all are enjoying my content and lets the algorithm also know that this is content worth viewing. So that'd be great. <laughs> and if you are interested in supporting my artwork um, more fully, I guess, I have my Etsy shop link in bio and I'm also on Miria, which is a black owned business or black owned website for black businesses. And I'm also on there if you want to check me out feel free um, to purchase a print from me because that helps me out a lot. And yeah, all right, let's get into the video. I'll see you at the end, maybe. Alrighty, hey y'all. So today is um, November 6th, I think. I wanted to take y'all through the process of doing a commission, um, or how I do a commission, not necessarily how you have to, but I was working out with my client about what she wanted for the sketch, what she wanted for the look. This is the final sketch I came up with, which I really love. So I'm actually doing this piece on this watercolor paper, one of my favorites. It's by Fluid 100 Cold Press Finish, 140 pound paper. And so I wanted to bring the sketch into Procreate on my iPad just to get an um, idea of what colors I want to use because I really want to make sure uh, the colors I use are cohesive since there are a lot of different elements going on. So I'm gonna do a quick, quick, quick uh, color rendering. Hopefully it won't take too long of what I want everything to look like um, for the most part to make sure everything is nice and cohesive. And I wanted to take y'all through the process to show y'all uh, kind of a time lapse of what this looks like. And yeah, let's go.
so today is uh, November 7th and I wanted to pop in a little bit, update y'all what I'm working on. So today is very um, busy but a lot of like awesome art business stuff that I'm going to be working on which is very exciting. Um, so I'm about to get ready to package some orders. I always get so freaking excited when y'all order for me because like ugh, it's just so much fun to package orders and I love seeing like who orders my stuff and where it comes from and everything and it's always just so such a treat such a treat to see uh, y'all enjoying my artwork and seeing it on your walls and such so it's always very exciting uh, if you're ever interested in ordering from me I have my Etsy shop link in bio I offer free shipping and uh, everything is made in package with love so yes so I'm gonna package these let's see these, these orders y'all probably saw the footage of me getting everything printed and cut at FedEx if y'all don't know that's where I get my prints done um nobody really ever seems to talk about it but fedex has some really good quality stuff like y'all are missing out um i feel like especially for beginner artists or for artists who are like like me like in college um or don't have um like don't want to get like a lot of stuff in stock um because for me i don't want to get to that point yet until i have like a consistent uh customer basis um there'll be more in the future but honestly this is really good and it's like really cheap also to get your stuff printed um i usually get my products printed on 100 pound matte paper and it's been really good for me honestly um like this is like one of my prints this is uh one of the prints someone ordered which is very exciting this is the first one someone ordered of this specific uh, piece that I did uh, called Melanin Pride, so I am really happy to package this one up. Today is Sunday, so I am feeling kind of like lethargic. <laughs> I was talking to y'all on Instagram on my stories. Uh, if y'all don't know, I always like update on Instagram what I'm up to, and I love chatting with y'all and getting connected and everything, and hearing about what y'all are up to. So right now I'm feeling kind of like it's very very tired. Um, but it's been a very good day so far. I was able to do my routine. I met up with a client for another commission, which is so exciting. I'm really excited to get this piece started. Um, so I'm going to package these orders today. And then what's next on the agenda? My stepdad is coming. So I'm going to go grab lunch with him or I guess a late lunch or early dinner kind of situation. Um, and then I am going to work on a commission piece. Um, one of mine, get, get started on painting that, upload uh, some products to Miria, which is a black owned business app and website. I've just took out my products on there and it's a more complicated process to upload. Um, not more complicated, but there are just more steps involved than my usual Etsy um, setup. So it takes me a little bit longer to put my products on there. So I'm going to do that today. Then I also need to figure out how the heck to do my camera repair if y'all can't tell like this is filming on my iphone um and i had a nikon camera that sadly took a little bit of a tumble and i'm trying to figure out what to do with her to repair it because i think it, it is a fixable issue i think something like the sensor isn't working or something got like a little bit jumbled into in the camera system which is kind of very much upsetting um so hopefully i'll be able to figure that out i think i might end up having to send the camera to like the main like nikon manufacturer and then see what can be done from there uh but i just want to get started and trying to figure out like what steps to take because i really miss that quality of footage on my videos and i want that back so <laughs> also this morning i didn't really feel like filming it but i was working on a drawing project for my drawing class it's like our final project we have to do a halloween charcoal illustration kind of thing and i'm really proud of it so far because i usually don't work in charcoal as y'all know and i usually don't do stuff like this so uh i really like how it's going so far so let me show you how she's looking hopefully i don't get charcoal everywhere so this is the work in progress right now it's this is on like i think it's 18 by 24 paper maybe it's on newsprint paper um not that big of a fan of i don't like doing stuff on bigger scale at least like with the charcoal but um it's okay though i really like how it's turning out so far i really love how the statue is looking um or how it's how it turned out i think it looks pretty sick <laughs> and yeah i still have quite a ways to go 
and it's due on Wednesday. So let's get started. I'm gonna package these orders and yeah, I'll take you out along the process as always. Yeah, I hope y'all are having a good Sunday. Let's go. <laughs> also, I'm so freaking excited because I can finally use uh, these thank you cards. I think I used one of them before. I don't remember, but I love using these little cards that got printed. I really like this little illustration that I did and I'm so glad I can use these cards and send them off to these lovely, lovely customers. Uh, so yeah, if you would like a freebie little thank you uh, print, it's still, it's very, very cute illustration in my opinion, and also some free stickers and an amazing print by yours truly, hit me up, you know, hit me up. I'm always available. Etsyshop.com slash, wait, no, Etsy.com slash chamomiles. Chamom <laughs> I cannot speak slash chamomiles, however you want to uh, pronounce it. <laughs> yes, I'm so excited. People don't know you don't have to be perfect to be worthy of like things you desire, to be worthy of your dreams or to like do something. Like you don't have to wait to be perfect to do anything. I didn't wait to be perfect and I'm not waiting to be perfect to share who I am. So I think that's one thing. I think that's a great, great point. I think like, especially when I look at like, other musicians or like up and coming musicians or people who just want to do anything. It's like, yes, I'm perfect. It's like nothing will ever be perfect. Just will put it out ever there. Be perfect. Just yeah. I feel well rested. Um, you know what? Actually, I do like an early morning. So let's say I wake up around seven, but I've slept really well. I slept a full eight hours. Today is November 9th, and I just wanted to stop in really quick, really quick, really quick, <laughs> and do a quick little um, unboxing little thing, I guess unpackaging, because uh, I ordered a while ago from one of my favorite artists on Instagram. Their name is One Nillion, and I'm absolutely obsessed with uh, her work. She's one of my biggest like inspirations right now because I love the colors she uses, and it's just mwah, so good. I went through a little bit of like unboxing or unpackaging, and I ordered from her a while ago, and I was worried that it never came because the school never notified me, because usually they notify if I get a package. Um, I didn't realize they put it in my mailbox, so it came like, on time <laughs> but i just didn't realize it so i'm so excited um but here's a little look how adorable this freaking stamp is oh my gosh i love seeing at other artists packaging because like just very inspiring to see like oh i didn't think of um this method or like oh i'd like like to have this in my future packaging because if you all know i do use um i recycle all my packaging and such and i reuse uh, envelopes and especially padded envelopes. I reuse those. Oh, not my address showing. Not my address showing. <gasps> oh, this is beautiful. Look how adorable. This is the one that I ordered. This is one of my favorite prints from her, or one of my favorite pieces from her. But the quality is so nice. Like, it's very thick and like 
Very nice. <laughs> this freaking beautiful, amazing human threw in another prince just for funsies? Like, I just ordered one. Bro, freebies make me so happy. Look how freaking cute. A holographic. <laughs> I'm definitely gonna put this on my water bottle. I have it right here. Like, maybe like here or here like there there if you have the money um go out and buy stuff from your favorite artist because it is very much appreciated and also we work very hard and or if you don't have the money be sure like share your favorite artist like etsy page or shop anywhere on your instagram or facebook or anything because even if you're not able to like support by purchasing it still means so much by like sharing our shop around because you never know who can see it um but yeah i'm so excited definitely highlight of the day oh my god oh wow 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 look at life look at us who would have thought who would have thought <laughs> Oh my gosh, hi, crazy to see you here. Oh my goodness, are you like following me? This is getting kind of crazy. <laughs> I hope you all enjoyed today's video um, and the little snippets I've included. I've really been enjoying interacting with y'all lately, especially in the YouTube comments and on my Instagram. If you're not familiar, I do have an Instagram where I post my story. I try to post pretty much every day and interact with y'all because I love like having my little community of y'all lovely supporters, my family. Um, my Instagram is at camomiles if you're interested in following me and seeing my art in a high resolution, getting more frequent updates from yours truly. And don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe for more content. And I will see you next week, okay? I love you. Bye.